What is up guys, it's BB Gamer here, and today I'm going to be doing a quick tutorial on how to make a, like, the color change that I've been using in, um, some of my intros. So, like, example, example, um, actually, here, we'll go to an even better example, because I'm not very good at it, but, um, this one right here, like, this is like the, see, it's like a big phase in, like, intro making right now, um, so I'm just going to do, like, the color changes, like, right yeah, color change, color change. I don't know. It won't be as complex as that, but you can you can make it more complex and stuff. So let's first start by opening up your After Effects. I'm using CS6 because I ran out of money to pay for CC, so I just went because I can't pay you monthly. It's just too expensive. So I went out and bought this snazzy piece of thing. Well, I already had it, but I can't use CC, and it kind of makes me mad because there's less stuff for CS6. Whatever. No, that's whatever. Not important. Um, so make a new composition, uh, I'll just call it count, I guess, I don't even need to mess with it. Um, most of my intros are 1280 by 720 I accidentally made the last intro I made in, um, 1920 by 1080 which kind of screwed me up because it made the syncing really hard, because I couldn't go down to 100% because that would be too small for it, so I had to, like, scale it up, and it was a nightmare, it took me forever, and it killed me inside, and it was a sync intro, too. And it was a paid one, so I had to make it, so... It was my first page one, by the way, too. So just saying. Oh, my doorbell rang. One sec. Go back. All right. Sorry about that. That was like a package or something. Get out of here. All right. Uh, God dang it, dog. No, sit. Go somewhere else. Literally just let him outside. Not happening. Not going outside. So only 10 seconds long. Um, look all good here. So just click enter. Um, I gotta let my dog out. All right. One sec. Okay. Hopefully we've had enough distractions for this recording. I just got a new call. Why is everyone bothering me right now? Okay. We'll just ignore them. So, let's import our, like, intro, I guess. Oh, by the way, I'm making a top five intros, so. <laughs> yeah. All right. Oh, okay. And they're, like, they're, like, smaller intros that not many people know about, so it makes it better and stuff. So, whatever. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. Oh, my gosh. This is just not a good recording for me. All right, so now that you've got your intro in, um, I usually start by just doing a little, we don't need it in full, we can make, oh my god, the computer, not the time. All right, so, what the frick, what are you doing? Get out. Okay, so I usually like to start by just, you know, doing a little RAM preview of it, just to, holy crap, this is going to take a long time. Good lord. Oh my, my computer is slow today. Close this, maybe? Jesus. Jesus. Come on, get out. Wow. Alright, we're gonna have to be... Um, okay, well, this be good enough for that. That's good enough, good enough. Stop, stop doing that. Stop. Okay. 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 So, we can just stop right there. So that's all we need, I guess. So that, I don't know. If, if it was like an actual intro, I'd render it farther. But we'll just make the color change like right. I don't know. We need, to, we need to render like a good part of it. Why is it doing this? Come on. So close. Alright. So now that we have part of it rendered. You're gonna make a new layer. So new um, adjustment layer. So we're gonna make an adjustment layer because we're making an adjustment, I guess. So yeah. Um, now we're gonna do effect color correction hue slash saturation, and this should work with pretty much every like type of like After Effects. All right, because this is like the most basic, one of the most basic things. So. Um, so let's do, okay, first I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to make another one, so control D to duplicate this layer, and then I'm going to click P for position, and I'm going to drag, well, not that way, I'm going to drag one over, like, halfway, so we can do, like, half of it, or something like that, I don't know, if I wanted to do, like, a different, like, a, like a corner of it, I could drag this down, and actually, let's do a corner of it, I guess, I don't even know, I don't care, so, um, Let's make it do something so we can tell where it is. We'll make it like there. So you can just drag the master hue. That's how you change the color. 
So, yeah, so I um, P for position on the other one. And we'll just drag this one up. And this is how I do it. People might do it other ways. I don't even know. But this is how I do it. And we're just going to make it full just so I can see like crisp lines. And make this one like a blue. How does that look? Okay, they're a little bit off. Uh, you probably want to zoom in at this point to just make sure that you're right on. But I'm going to say that's probably close enough. All right, now we're going to duplicate them again. We're going to make two more. Um, P for position again. And drag it. Actually, just drag it over. Right there looks good to me. And then the last one, P for position, yet again. Okay, I probably should duplicate the one on top just so it's easier. Which one D? P for position. Move it all the way over. What the frick? Oh, I'm reading the wrong one. Sorry. My bad. Alright, move it over. And, alright, we're going to change the master hue of this. Make it purple. Nope, that's how it started. Make it yellow. This is the last one. This is the last one. Whatever, we can change this one anyways. Let's make this one like red. I don't know. Whatever, you probably don't want to choose better colors than that. But, that that is how you change the color. And these are white, so I don't, it doesn't affect white, because white is already like, what the, f update finished. 33 drivers, good. Oh. What does it want me to do? I don't know, get out of here. So, let's just get rid of these drop downs. And see so now it's got it. We've got it changed. And some people put like little um, lines in in front of the things, whatever. So the way you to do that is just to make like a shape. I think I think that's how they do it. That's how I would do it. So I just make like a shape layer that goes like here. I don't even know. Like that maybe. Maybe. I don't know. But you just put that in front and just put it in the corners. I don't know. That's how I would do it, but I don't do that. So, yeah, now you've got it like that, and you can have it. So, maybe this one goes first, and then you have like another one, like right afterwards, like that, maybe. So, maybe we have it like that. I don't know. The choice is yours. My, my old, uh, I used to have an art teacher. Wait a moment. That's really slow. Let's go like that. And I'm probably going to want to cut them off somewhere, but I don't know. Whatever. But. Okay, I want to make it like pretty fast change. Like that, maybe. That's maybe a little too fast. But. Okay, this isn't to like watch me mess around for a while. Um, and then you probably want to make him like disappear. So I guess you could do like key for opacity, maybe, and like go a couple frames back, keyframe, frame up. Zero. Oh, that's... oh geez, we don't want them all to go away at the same time, do we? No, we don't. I don't know. Okay, I'm just messing it up now. But um, yeah, that's what you would probably want to do. It's just to do that. That's how you do it. Um, and the keyframe would be up to you. I'm just kind of messing it up now. Um. So yeah, that's how you that's how you do a color change. Um, and now it's going way faster. That's good. All right. Oh. That's how you do it. So 
Hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, this tutorial hopefully was helpful for you. What happened to the one? Oh, the other one. Remember this guy. Hopefully this tutorial helped you out, and hopefully um, this just showed you how to do something that's pretty cool and that a lot of people use nowadays. So if you have any questions, just be sure to leave them in the comments, because I would be happy to um, show you what to do and hopefully help you out. Uh, I don't know everything, obviously, so I might not be able to answer your question. But hopefully I can. Let's say you do black and white, by the way. Um, but hopefully I can, and yeah. That's weird. Uh, but yeah, hopefully I can. So, uh, yeah, be sure to subscribe and like the video and check out my other videos because, yeah, swag. Um, hope you guys enjoyed. See you. Oh, I'm working on an intro tutorial for that tutorial intro I made a long time ago. And I'm working on it, but it's taking a while. And I want my new intro, which is being made by Pirate Designs, to be made. And it's taking a while. So, um, once my intro gets made, then I will upload the video. So hopefully it happens soon. So yeah, remember to subscribe, comment, like. See you all later. Take care.